Hey, hope that you're doing well. I uh, just wanted to do a quick check-in to see how you're doing. Uh, remember to do your best to stay in a positive headspace and to ground yourself, meditate, visualize, and invoke the feeling as if you already have what it is you're trying to visualize. I'm about to go down for meditation myself and probably do a quick walk outside just to get some fresh air, and I'll check on you later. Hey everyone, I wanted to do a quick check-in as I said that I would. Hope that you're doing well. Um, I am out getting some fresh air, being present as possible, and also making sure that I keep myself safe by practicing social distancing as much as I possibly can. Um, meditation. To me, meditation is going inward to yourself to find the answers from your heart. Um, I'm pretty sure there are some more um, in-depth definitions, but that's just me, my personal experience. The benefits of meditating for me have been being able to get the answers of my heart by being truly vulnerable with myself, being raw, um, telling it like it is, and playing back the behaviors that may have contributed to why I'm in the situation that I'm in, um, or interacting with the people that I am to get clarity on what I needed to do to move forward. Uh, I started to meditate after I lost my aunt, who was a part of my nuclear family. It's super small. Um, and that it was a big impact on me. Sent me into a depression. Um, saw a therapist, saw a psychiatrist, lost a lot of sleep. But I'm glad that that happened because it was the trigger that allowed me to awaken. Um, fast forward, meditating allowed me to play back the life experiences that I had that contributed to me um, internalizing everything that I did. Um, and as I had the safe space to play back everything, um, I started to understand the why behind it. And as I understood the why behind it, I was able to modify my behaviors in my best interest. So one of the things that I will share with you that I personally went through is as a giver, um, I'm always, 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 always giving, 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 giving to the point where I um, I don't have anything left to give. I just have fumes, you know? And the impact of that is uh, being short, being snappy, being cold, being everything that I shouldn't be. And through meditating, I started to replay some interactions that I had with people and start to ask why. And the source of everything became um, that I wasn't conscious or mindful or aware, self-aware of what I was doing in my behavior. So now when I interact with people, I pull myself into the present by grounding and then I listen with both ears and I don't talk. Hi. And then <clears throat> as I listen, then I dig deeper in my, to myself and understand what this has to do with me and my quest, which I feel is to become a highly effective author, coach, speaker, or trainer to help people operate at their highest potential. And as a result of be me, me being mindful of my behaviors, my life has changed so much. So I hope that you find this helpful to you. If I had to summarize everything, you meditate because it gives you the space and clarity to be honest and raw and be okay with that. Forgive yourself for it. And you do that because it allows you to play back the things that you've done in life that may contribute to where you are and why you're there. And of course, because you have that sacred space, that safe place to 
be vulnerable with yourself and you play back what you've done and the possible reasons why, you can then understand what behaviors you need to change. Hope that this has been helpful to you. Remember, ground yourself in the present, meditate, visualize, feel, and let it go. Have a great one.